I'm J.D. Durkin reporting from the floor of the New York Stock Exchange, and here's a look at what we're watching on the street today. Stocks are looking to continue their positive run after a pair of back-to-back -back record sessions led to fresh all-time highs for market indexes last week. Several big names will report earnings over the next five days, including BuzzFeed, Carnival, and GameStop. Investors will also be on the lookout for a slew of economic indicators in the next few days. The Consumer Confidence Index comes out on March 27th. Weekly jobless claims out on Thursday. And, of course, the latest PCE report is set to be released on Friday. In other news, the European Union says it suspects some of the biggest names in tech are not complying with its newly implemented Digital Markets Act. Meta, Apple, and Google are now all under investigation for what the EU says is a failure to promote digital competition. The Digital Markets Act requires platforms to give users more of a choice when it comes to things like shopping or travel. The law applies to companies that the EU calls the gatekeepers. Those companies are Amazon, Apple, Google, Microsoft, Meta, and TikTok parent ByteDance. And Elon Musk's X and travel site Booking.com could soon be added to the list. The EU is currently investigating Meta's pay or consent system in which users can pay up to $14 a month for ad-free versions of the platforms. The European Commission says it is, quote, concerned that the binary choice imposed by Meta's pay or consent model may not provide a real alternative in case users do not consent, thereby not achieving the objective of preventing the accumulation of personal data. If the EU finds there was, in fact, a lack of compliance with the DMA, the companies found guilty would be heavily fined. That'll do it for your daily briefing. From the floor of the New York Stock Exchange, I'm J.D. Durkin with The Street.